Hey guys, it's Casey from Yoga Squared and my little mini. This is Penny. Say hi, Penny. Hi. So we got some requests from um, from some moms in the community. Um, can we please have some kids yoga videos? And the answer is yes. So we have at least a week or two to be here with our kids and um, it's raining um, for most of the week. So here's something fun that you can do with your kid indoors, um, get your bodies moving and get your brain nice and calm and happy. So in order to participate in this video, um, you're going to need only one piece of equipment. You're going to need a ball. So go ahead and pause the video now and go get a ball and then we'll reset in just a moment. Okay, magic of TV has happened. Everybody's gotten a ball. I'm gonna set the ball off to the side for now. But we're gonna get started tuning into our breath. So Penny, go ahead and sit crisscross applesauce. Perfect. Put your hands on your knees. Perfect. Yeah, there you go. All right, now close your eyes and try and sit up tall. Now imagine that you have a pole going up your back all the way from where your bottom is. Go ahead and wiggle your bottom. Wiggle your bottom into the floor. You feel your bottom, the two bones? Okay, so now start to feel, now your rib cage. Feel your rib cage. We want you to feel that hovering right above your bottom. Okay, now find your shoulders. Okay, now your shoulders are right over your ribs. You feel them? Yeah. Okay, now I want you to find your ears. Are your ears right over your shoulders? Yeah. They're not, they're not here, right? No? Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's right here? Okay, perfect. All right, now find the top of your head. Okay, so you should feel like blocks. Top of your head, ears, shoulders, ribs, and booty. All <laughs> one line. Okay, so keep that nice and straight. Hands go on your knees. And now I want you to imagine a big balloon in your belly. Okay, we're gonna fill up our balloon. So let's go ahead, fill it up. Take a deep breath in through your nose. Fill up your balloon. Now start to let your balloon let its air out, nice and slow like you're blowing out birthday candles. All right, fill up your balloon again. Deep breath in. You want to feel your balloon? If you want to feel your balloon? All right, blow out some birthday candles. Good, one more time. Fill up your balloon. And blow out your birthday candles. All right. We're gonna reach our hands forward. Show me your hands like starfish. Good. So I want you to start to pull on one little leg of the starfish. What do you feel when you do that? You feel a stretch? Yeah. Where is it, just in your hand? No. Where is it? Does it go? On your pinky. On your pinky, do you feel it go up here too? Yeah. Okay, let's go, each one. All right, now ring finger, middle finger, pointer finger, Gonna make a stop sign with your hand. Find your thumb, you know, pull it down. Ooh, and not so much that it hurts, right? Just enough so you feel a stretch in your hand, right? So that's too much. You don't wanna be at the point where it hurts, right? So just enough to where like, oh, I feel something. We never wanna hurt ourselves. Okay, now other, starfish, okay? Now pull one leg of the starfish, good. Middle, good, your pointer. And then make a stop sign. Stop. Okay, now pull. Good. This one feels different, a lot different. You know what's funny is that our, our bodies feel different on each side because the muscles on each side of your body do different things. Mm -hmm. Because what, what hand do you write with? Okay. Which one do you write with? You write with this one, right? Yeah. Yeah, so the hand that you write with will sometimes be a little bit more tense than the one that you don't write with because it does more stuff. Okay, you ready? We're gonna bring our arms out to a T. Letter T. Here, I'll scoot over so there's more room for you. Okay, letter T. Now give yourself a big hug. Good. Yeah, and let's just go side to side. Good. Do you feel a stretch anywhere? Yeah. Where? Not sure? Mm -mm. I feel it between my shoulders on my back. So now go ahead and bring your nose in. Smell your heart. <laughs> right? Oh my right, God. you can smell it. All right, now lift up, take a big sniff of the air. Air smells good. Air smells good, okay. <laughs> Go down, take a big sniff of your heart. Well, that smells <laughs> Does that smell funny? All right, let's go. Uh oh, this is bath time. Maybe, no. All right, let's go ahead and lift up. You remember which arm's in front? We're going to switch which arm's on top. So give yourself opposite hug. Boom. I don't know. That's all right. 
Did you forget? That's okay. Don't worry. So now we'll do this side to side a couple times. Good. Now let's try something. We're gonna wind ourselves all the way up like a twisty tie. So you're gonna lift your arms up and wrap them up. I do this a lot. Do you do this a lot? Yeah. It's really easy for the kids, not so much for the grown-ups. So I want you to put it in front of your face. I see. I, I like sit like this. Yeah? Okay, so bring your hands straight up and down. There you go. Okay, now put your face so that way you can't see. Okay, so put your face behind your arms. Now I want you to peekaboo out to one side. Peekaboo. Peek Good, back to center. Now uh, peekaboo, other side. Good. One more time. Peekaboo. Good. One more time. Peekaboo. Good. All right, let's go ahead. Shake out. Shake it out. Seriously. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Mom. lift your arms up. Okay, take a deep breath in. Exhale, fold. Reach, 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 reach. Now keep your buns down. Don't lift your buns up. Yep, you gotta reach forward. Okay, so we're gonna walk our hands this way, okay? Walk your hands over. Walk, 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 walk. Okay. Oh, feels so good. You feel stretch right here, honey? Yeah. Good. That's our equipment that we're gonna need. Don't push that away. We need yeah. that. <laughs> yeah. I just like it. Mm. All right, you ready? You're gonna come back to center. <laughs> Let's go the other way. Oh, that feels so good. <laughs> hey. I'm on your knee. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Okay, let's come back to center. You're gonna inhale, that means breathe in through your nose, all the way up. Good, now nice deep breath out, hands to your heart. All right, this is my favorite. It is, this mm -hmm. is your favorite? How come? Does this feel peaceful? It's comfortable. Is it comfortable? Now let's take a moment. Now go ahead, close your eyes, put your hands together, and think about something that you're really grateful for, which means something that you're thankful to have. What your do you best think? friend. You're thankful for your best friends? Me too. I'm thankful. I'm thankful for you. I'm thankful that I have gymnastics. I'm thankful that you have gymnastics too. All right, you ready to, should we play some? Yeah. Okay, so let's turn and face one another. So let's go ahead and turn and face, face your kiddo. So turn, face your body. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Not all right. So I want you to extend your legs out. Okay. Yep. Can you bring your feet to my feet? Perfect. Okay. All right, now of course we're gonna hold hands after we've washed our hands for 20 seconds singing happy birthday twice, right? Okay, so go ahead and reach forward, grab onto each other's hands. Okay, now I want you to pull me. Oh, no, that's hard, slowly. Okay, so let's try that again. So you've done nothing forceful, just nice and slow. Pull me, pull me, pull me, pull me, pull me. Oh, that's good. All right, now I'm gonna pull you. Look at that, look at that. Okay, now you pull me, looks like a seesaw. Back and forth. Good. Come on back up. One more time. All right. Good. All right. Sit up tall. All right. So now I want you to reach. You reach for that foot. I'll reach for this foot. Good. I got your foot. <laughs> I got your foot. I got your foot. Okay. Yeah. Can you reach up? Give me a high five. All right, we're gonna rainbow up and over. Rainbow, big rainbow, 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 rainbow. Other foot. Boom. <laughs> that was funny. Is that funny? It looks like a diamond. Ring. It does look like a diamond. If you have diamonds on your foot. Okay. Oh my gosh, what a small world. All right, let's lift up. Big rainbow, 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 rainbow. Also. Awesome. Another side. Again. Good. We're gonna go back and forth, right? Up, down. Up, down. One more time. All right, we're gonna come through center. Open up, make like a big crocodile mouth. Good. Now start to reach forward. Good. Now both of us will pull back. You lean back. <laughs> Good. Oh, you're too strong for me. All right, let's sit up tall. All right. Now let's bring our feet together. All right, feet together. Good. Now I want you to reach forward. Let's see if we can high five in the middle. Good. Try to keep your legs straight and back straight. Do you feel, are your legs stretching? Yeah. Are you breathing? Yeah. All right, you gotta breathe too. Everybody right? breathes. Well, sometimes now, sometimes you get a big stretch and you go, <laughs> and you hold your breath. Yeah, don't do that. You gotta breathe when you're when you're doing yoga. Right? Ow. Okay, Ow. all right, bring your hands back. Let's put our feet flat on the floor. Ow. So scooch back. I, yeah, I come this way. Hurt my... 
Careful. All right, so now we can keep our feet towards one another. You see what shape I'm making? I'm on my hands, so come up onto your hands. Fingers facing forward. There you go. Okay, all right, let's make a bridge. This is my favorite. Yeah, like you let your head tilt back. It looks like, oh. Uh, you ready? Down, put your buns down. 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 Yep. Yeah. Now put your feet up. Down. Feet foot high five. Boom. Okay, now put your feet down. Lift up, London Bridge. London Bridge is falling down. Okay. Falling down, buns down, are coming down. down. Foot high five. Boom. One more time. Lift up. London Bridge is falling down. Falling down. Falling down. <laughs> All right, buns come down. down. Foot high five. We're going to hold our foot high five. Can you let go and balance? No problem? Mm -hmm. No problem, huh? Okay. All right, oh, nice. <laughs> All right, can, can you lift your feet away? Lift them away. Oh, use your belly, 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 belly. Oh. All right, so that brings us to our first game. So go ahead and locate your ball that you got at the beginning of the video. And we're going to start off passing it with our hands. All right, we're going to pass it around in a circle. Uh, right. <laughs> That's it. No, Boring. Yeah. Right. Okay. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this is right. Anybody can pass the ball around in a circle. Yeah. So this is where it's fun if you have more than one kid in the house. You can really make a big circle. Yogis like to do everything a little bit more. So we're gonna pass it back and forth with our feet. Seriously. Seriously. Okay. So scoot back in so that way you're in the frame. There we go. No. Yeah. In here. Put your hands up. Right. Pass. Okay. Can you grab mine? <laughs> you got you gotta keep your hands on the ground and balance. Good, now let go. No, don't drop it. <laughs> okay. All right, I'm okay. going to give it to you. Grab on. Okay. <laughs> now you move. <move. laughs> now you give it to me. Moms, this is a great core workout. <laughs> and your yeah. kids think it's hysterical. <laughs> no, it's and so we, hard. It's hard. It's hard. <laughs> Woo. Okay, all right. That was so hard. Ready? Ready. Okay. Yeah, pass it back and forth a couple times. Oh, gosh. Oh, that's a good idea. All right, let's see if we can... Toss it back and forth with our feet. Ready? Go, you ready to catch it. Yeah. Cool. Cool. <laughs> I'll let it touch the ground. <laughs> oh my. Alright, make sure you put all your breakables away. Alright. One more time. I'm gonna lift it up high. I'm gonna lower it to you. Oh good. That's hard, huh? Alright, okay, I'm gonna balance it. Okay, can you do that? Here, I'll give yeah. it to you. Now flex your feet. Balance. Okay, I'll be right back. Just kidding. <laughs> no, keep it lifted. Is that hard on the tummy? Are we done? No, Is your belly tired? Legs. Oh, on your legs right here? Yeah, right here. Oh, on the hip flexors. All right, let's stretch out your hip flexors. So we don't need the ball right now. We'll roll it out of the way. Let's come on into hands and knees. So you face me. I know. Oh, social distancing. Scoochie. Thank you. All right, okay. All right, let's draw your belly down. So you're going to go like this. Cow. Cow. Moo. <laughs> Moo to you. Click, clack, moo. Click, clack, moo. Okay, now we're going to make a cat shape. So push through your, flatten your hands down, Kenny. There you go. Round your back. And then bring your nose into your belly. All right, this is cat pose. Meow. Meow. All right, belly meow. down. Meow. Belly down. Cow pose. Moo. Click, clack, moo. Pass that tight. Moo. All right, let's go ahead and push into our hands. Meow. Meow. Okay. All right, let's bring ourselves into a regular tabletop shape. And Penny, can you grab that little bag of tricks in there? Okay, so inside this bag, I have lots of different animals. So what I'll need you to do, My Penny, toys. yeah, these are Penny's toys. You don't need to have your own toys to play this. We'll show you exactly what to do. So I'm gonna have you grab one and then you're gonna go show it to the camera what it is. And then we're gonna let them create their own shape and then we'll show them the shape, okay? So you get to be creative and make a shape and then I'll show you the yoga pose for it, okay? Close your eyes. Some yogi magic in there. All right, go ahead, choose the first one. All right, what do we got? A dog. Okay, go ahead, show, show them the dog. Perfect. All right, take a look at what the dog is doing. All right, Penny, can you make a dog shape? I'll move from the mat. Why don't you show me a dog pose? What do you think a dog looks like? That looks, that looks like it. So they're not. No, 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 no. <laughs> yeah, you know, you're not wrong there. All right, so go ahead, give yourself a try. You start to make like a dog. Look, look around. What might what, what you be able to make? No, she, he actually. I know, we'll look at that later. So yeah. now if you want to learn the yoga pose for a dog, and there's two dog poses. We're going to do two. 
So I'll show you the first one, Penny. I'll show you the first one, Penny. So go ahead, sit off to the side. The first one is called, yeah, perfect. The first one is downward facing dog. You've probably seen this one favorite. before. You make an upside down V shape with your body. Yeah, so your, your buns are the highest point in your body. That's what and you do with Yeah, right, you can wag your tail. <laughs> okay. okay, and the other one, we've all seen our dogs do this when they're tired, is upward facing dog. Your yeah. arms are straight, and you're like, oh, you ever see a dog when they first yeah. wake up? Like, I, oh, I, 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 see Howie, I see Howie when he's tired. Yeah. He's like, Ugh. All right, Penny, you try. You try this. Down dog, so the upside down. I shape. know that one's really good. Okay, let's yeah. see. So you guys try too. So you can walk your hands a little bit farther forward. There you go. Now buns up high. Try and send your buns towards me. Yes, there we go. Uh, now try the other one. Beautiful. Good. Nice job, everybody. Wait, wait. Okay. This is my favorite. What one? Yeah, you can kind of go between the two. Yeah, you can play around with yoga poses. That's the best part. Is it's basically using your body like a toy. All right. It's called inchworm. It, those are inchworms? Uh -huh. Yeah, I like that. Okay, what else is in here? Shark. Shark. We're going to call this a fish, okay? Fish pose. All right, so go ahead and make a fish with your body. You make a fish with your body. You guys make a, a fish shape with your body. Look at you. Oh, that's <laughs> very creative. Good. Okay, so I'm going to show you how to do the yoga pose. I know. Fish. Well, boat is kind of like this. Yeah, we did, we did boat already. That little ball game that we did, that was with uh -huh. boat pose. So. Yeah. I'm kind of unsure why this is called fish pose because it doesn't really look like a fish. So you come down on your buns. That does not look like You a put fish. your hands under your buns. That does not look like a fish. I know. Enough. Well, first of all, fish don't have hands. You're going to lay down so you're on your forearms. Oh okay. Puff your chest up, point your toes, tilt okay. your head back. This is fish pose. Oh you can get God. really fancy and lift up. Or point your toes too. Good. All right, Penny, you want to try? Yeah. You guys try too. So you start off sitting down on your bottom. Good. You got to sit on your hands. Oh, okay. cards. For, so face, uh -huh. palms facing down. Other way. So flip your hand the other way. I like the other way. Well, it's not going to work out. Oh my God. It Here, work. this way. This way. So rotate your fingers in. There you go. All right. So go ahead and lay down onto your forearms. Good. So this one. Yep. That's it. Now puff this part up. Now tilt your head back. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Good job. Beautiful. Very nice. Good. I'm nice job, everybody. Yeah. Yoga and gymnastics are very similar. So if you guys that are watching this video, if you do gymnastics, there's a lot that's similar. We don't need this yet. I'm going to put it off to the side. Okay. All right, Penny. Let's do the next one. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. What do you got in there? Just one. Just one works. Uh, Rarity. <laughs> Rarity. Well, horse, okay? I know it's a unicorn, right, but horse, okay? Horse pose. All right, now you guys go ahead and make up a horse pose. Penny, you make up a horse pose. Wait, wait I want to do what she's doing. That is, that's very accurate, I have to tell you. Okay, so let me show you now how to do a horse pose. So this is the simplest version. I just copy them. Here it is. I know what even it knows. I know it. They are. How does this make a horse? Where's the horse in this pose? The feet. I'm riding it. Uh, <laughs> All right, yeah, your turn. You guys try. <laughs> now, squat low. Get down, hold. Yes. <gasps> hold it. No, grab. Yeah, that's a whole nother <laughs> animal. <laughs> All right, are we ready for... Uh, Let's do another one. We'll do, we'll do a couple Find more. Rarity. Oh, sorry. I forgot to take her out. We already did rarity. Okay, next one. Ooh. I'm done. Mermaid pose. I'm done. That's it? Well, yeah, that's pretty accurate, right? So we got your mermaid tail. We got your fins. All right, so you guys make, how yeah, would you be a mermaid? <laughs> Lego mermaid pose. All right. Would, would you like to see how to do mermaid pose? Yes. Yeah, okay, yeah. go ahead. Sit over there. I'll show you. So Are you still a mermaid? So you start off. You slide one shin forward. That does not look like it. I know. And what's funny about this pose is it doesn't really look like a mermaid, except for that it's very pretty. So you start off here. Mm -hmm. Okay. And I look back over my back shoulder. I reach back for my foot and see if I can catch it. I'm a Lego. Okay. I'm going to try and slide my foot in. See that, Penny? Mm -hmm. I'm going to reach up and around. Do I have to do it? You can try it. 
I, I bet you can do it. Well, let's try it. Here, come on onto your hands and knees. I'm a Lego. Okay, no more Lego. Okay, come on onto your hands and knees and just put one shin forward. Okay, so hands and knees. Good. Now slide a shin forward. There you go. Now scooch this leg back. Like you're in a lunge. Scooch your knee back. Way back, way back, way back. Yep. Ow. There you go. Is that too much? So you might get there and discover that that's enough. Is that enough? Mm -hmm. So just try and relax there. There you go. That's it. That's the idea. <laughs> These poses are hard, huh? They're very hard. And they require a lot of patience, some of them. All right, Penny, there's two more left. We have a lot more shapes, so we'll only do two more. Can you pick two more animals? Cool. No, we don't have time for that. Ooh, okay. What do we got here? A butterfly. Butterfly. Okay, everybody, let's make a butterfly shape. What? 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 Make a butterfly shape. What? What's it called? Guess what? How do you do it? Penny got it. Oh. This is a butterfly. Yeah, you can fly. But yoga is all about being still, all right? So instead of flapping our knees up and down, That's we're just going to relax. Yeah. Yeah. And if you want, you can just, yep, oh, yeah, you can do that if no. you want to. Yep, you can do that. This is supposed to help you concentrate. It just gives you something to focus on. When you see, you know, people doing yoga, doing this, that's all that is, is I'm just concentrating. I'm keeping my hands this way. Well, let's go ahead. Oh, we can make antenna. Look. Antenna. Antenna. Or antenna. 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 No, two butterflies. Two butterflies, look, we're, we're two butterflies on a leaf. Look at that. Very good. All right, we got one more. One more. I only got one or two. Okay, choose the one that you really like. What do I Hmm, that's one. Pinkie Pie. Oh, whoops. We had two horses. Sorry. Sorry, Pinkie Pie, but you were supposed to be a horse. How about, how about this one? This is a good one. This one? No, this one. Only a dog. We already did a dog. There's duplicates in here. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. how, about, how about Pascal? He's a lizard. It's, how about a bear? We'll do both. We'll do a lizard and a bear. Okay, so and then we got little so, Pascal. So let's put these back. Okay, perfect. Yeah, we can do We'll save those for another time. Okay, so yeah. lizard and you know, we'll save the bear for another time too. We'll do lizard for our last one. Okay, so show me what do you think a lizard pose looks like? <laughs> Wait, actually. You're really close. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's it. So let me show you. Instead of having your foot between your hands like you did, so Penny had it like this. Excuse me. <laughs> you move your foot off to the side, and then you put your hands on the inside edge. You can have your knee. Oh, I saw that before. Yeah, you have your knee down or knee lifted. And then I kind of think, you know what those lizards, when they're in the sun, they do push-ups? Uh-huh. That's what they do to get yep. warm, hot. Is that what they're doing that? I thought it was to impress girls. Yeah, kind of. Well, they're doing push-ups like, hey, I'm the strongest lizard around. And then, right, so you try and you do it on the other side. Those lizards before there was next to one, there's two doing yeah, that I together, remember. and one was like, ah. <laughs> hey. All right, so that's it. Concludes our toy game. Come on back. We're gonna relax now. You ready? Yeah. All right. All right. So come on, come on, sit. And we're gonna be back to back, okay? Okay. Back to back. Yes, all right. Um, all right, no, no, we're just gonna relax now. Okay, so back back to back with whoever yours. Yes, lean into me. There we go. Yeah. And just take a couple breaths. Oh, there you are. And feel how nice it feels to move and stretch your body, your healthy body. So don't walk your, walk your hands you. forward. I'm walk your hands forward. behind you. Yeah. All right. We're going to come up. Penny, can you move your hands over to the left side of your body? That's it. Yep. Oh, my God. Find my leg. There you go. Good. All right. Let's go back to center. And then now find your hands on the right side of your body. Good. How is this so weird? 
Is that one more comfy? Yeah. All right. Let's come on back to center. Turn around. You're going to be kneeling. Go ahead, bring your hands to your heart. And then tip your chin in and bow to your partner. Thank you so much for being here for Kids Yoga. Hopefully we'll do more. High five to my lovely assistant, Penny. Say bye to everybody, Penny. Bye. Bye. Have fun. Um, hunger down in there. And then also, I just wanted to say, um, if you want to support the studio and the uh, online platform that we're offering during this um, interesting time, you can send over a donation via Venmo or PayPal um, to Casey Merkling, C-A-S-E-Y. M-E-R-K-L-I-N-G. Um, any amount is appreciated. Um, we're just trying to keep the business up and above water. So that way, when this craziness is over, we're able to offer full service to everybody. So thank you again for joining us. Of course, donation is optional. Hope you have lots of fun. I hope you have lots of toilet paper and um, good things to eat and fun things to do. All right. Thanks a lot. Namaste.